Right, over here. Just when I was enjoying solitude. I have retrieved your children. And finally, my little family is complete. Hello, Ratatoskr. Hello, Master Kratos. What you've accomplished for these realms is truly something I never thought possible. Uh, rest assured, good Master Brock would be proud beyond measure, even if only to express it in his love language of profane non-sequiturs. Ah, but he is terribly missed. Yes, he is. Now, there is one rather interesting development to apprise you of. The detonation of Asgard shook the world tree to its very roots, dislodging a great number of realm seeds. I thought you might wish to have them. My little way of saying, thank you for preventing my death by immolation. You are welcome. <sighs> what else is there? So were you always a freakishly large immortal squirrel, or...? <laughs> Don't forget handsome. No, I was once a regular squirrel. The same size as these wispy, spectral versions of myself, in fact. I was unremarkable. I stumbled upon the tree near what should have been the end of my life, the victim of a random act of predatory savagery. But the tree, it had other plans for an insignificant creature like me. But I have prattled on for far too long. I will leave you be, Master Kratos. Carry on, my friend. Do, do you not understand when the conversation is over? Ah, if I had a stomach, it'd be twisting right now. Odin is gone. There is no remaining threat. No, no. It's from excitement. Hardly any non-giants have gotten the great privilege of visiting the realm of the Jotnar. It's truly an honor to be among a very select few. Is Jotunheim. As beautiful as the stories. And then some. Companies here, Finn. Thank you, Buddha. Kratos, Vimir, Freya, it's good to see you. I wish to thank you for creating a path out of Asgard for us. Aye, a true pleasure to meet the lassie who saved our skins. Indeed. Your giant stuff magic is truly a marvel. We were so glad we got there in time. Freya, your brother's sacrifice won't be forgotten. It won't. I will say, you've made quite the impression on our Atreus's heart. Well, there. Oh, like you weren't thinking it, brother. Ahem. You're a cherished ally, Ingraboda. I hope we cross paths again. <laughs> I imagine we will. There's lots to do, and I'm just getting started.
Kratos? The last time you were here was because of Faye, right? You saw this in prophecy. Your son told me. It's a beautiful place to rest. It is what she wished. You painted these shrines. Some of them. Some I finished for my mother. Your work is beautiful. Your skill with a brush is unmatched, Angerboda. My son. He draws. He told me. Although he'd do well to learn from your use of color. We come from a long line of artisans, so he has it in him. He just needs some discipline to bring it out. <laughs> I like you. Angaboda, you are the last giant left in your name. No, actually. My grandmother, Gryla. She's, um, not really one for visitors, but she's still here. She's helping me forage at the moment. After all you've done, lass, she must be so proud to have a granddaughter such as yourself. She... She might be. Someday. I don't know quite yet, but I think it's a start. Freya, the flower. The flower. Incredible. What's in Svartalfheim? There may be more resources to gather. I'm with you.
Returning to Vanaheim? There may be ravens to hunt. Sounds like a plan. Careful, brother. You're covered in by Go! <laughs> 
Berserkers were tough. Well, I've been thinking about what you said, brother. Maybe it's time to let this go. Sloughing up a dead man's soul with this old sword isn't going to change the past. It is good to hear you say that. But I plan to face it regardless. What? After all your lecturing on vengeance and spite? It is not wise to let a malevolent spirit wander Midgard. But I needed to know you wanted this for the right reasons. Huh. Appreciate the sentiment, brother. Should we try to tell her what happened? She knows. Midgard. Almost missed it. Odin's raven spies still dwell there. Let's go. Back to Charlie? Yes. He's not going to be very happy with me. No. Charlie. I'm sorry, I was. I have no excuse for neglecting you. I will do my best to earn it.
Is someone inside? Yes. Warming up already, isn't it? Birger. Hello. What are you doing here? Keeping warm. Both of us. It is your home if you wish me to leave. No. It's good that he has someone. Will you stay? There is still much to be done. Then we will wait. And when it is time to rest, I will keep the hearth warm. Thank you, Birger. Beautiful. Merkweed.